But first, after cost overruns and start delays, we now know when you can ride Norfolk's new light rail system. It is on track for Friday, August 19th, and for three days, it's free. Ten of your sides, Lori Crouch, has been working this story all day for us. She joins us now with more. Lori? Well, Norf uh, Nicole, we are right across the street from the new Town Road parking lot, the park and ride lot for the light rail train system. It is one of the last items on the to-do list to prepare for light rail passengers. Business is good at Granby Pizza, and it's about to get better. It's very exciting, actually. It's exciting to watch it run, uh, practice runs. The tide will be rolling into 11 Norfolk stations with passengers beginning August 19th with a special thank you. On August the 19th, August the 20th, and August the 21st, we'll run free service for anyone who wants to, to board. Until then, the trains will run their regular schedule without passengers, a time to iron out kinks and prepare. So about every 10 minutes, a train is going to be passing through here. It's very important that people pay attention to the signals, uh, pay attention to their driving, their walking, and remember that trains will be running on a regular schedule beginning June the 27th. A project plagued with cost issues and delays seems now to be on track. It should be great for Norfolk. Uh, it's very different. Now, HRT President and CEO Philip Chouquet made it very clear today that the project will not exceed the $338 million budget. In fact, he said it may actually even come in under that. Now, starting on Monday, August 22nd, it will cost you $1.50 to ride the tide one way. Now, coming up at 6, let's go for a ride. We'll take you along on a ride down the tide tracks. That story's at 6. In Norfolk, I'm Lori Crouch, 10 on your side.